What is going on, JW Faction? My name is Joshua Williamson. So if you were to ask me what my favorite meat is besides steak, it would be pork belly. For this little video recipe, I'm going to show you how to make crispy pork belly. Very easy to make. Yes, it's time consuming, but in the end, it's worth it. This is one of my favorite meat dishes ever. So let's get started. To start off, get a pork belly, make sure it has a skin on, and also make sure it has a good amount of meat on it as well. It already has enough fat. But anyways, what you want to do is take a sharp knife and then score the skin just until you cut through the fat okay don't go too deep just go through the first layer of fat and scoring this is what allows the fat to render more and it allows the skin to become crispy at the end and also score across from those cuts too all right now we're going to season it. you can season it however you want but make sure one of the first seasonings you use is plenty of coarse kosher salt I'm also going to season with a little bit of black pepper and some garlic powder. Now, only the pepper and garlic powder is going to be on the meat side, okay? On the skin side, we're only going to season with coarse kosher salt. And make sure you use a lot of it, too. Then put the seasoned pork belly on top of a wire rack above a baking tray and put it in the refrigerator overnight. Okay, so it's the next day now. As you can see, all the salt has penetrated into the skin and also the salt we put on the meat has penetrated into the meat as well. Dry brine and the skin is also drier, but we're going to make it even drier by putting it in the oven at 250 degrees Fahrenheit. I think that's 120 degrees Celsius. Somebody correct me if I'm wrong, but you want to put it in for three and a half hours. All right, this is what the pork belly will look like when it comes out of the oven. I'm just going to let it cool off a little bit before we finish it off and make the skin crispy. Now it's time to crisp up the skin. Now in this cast iron, I put a thin layer of oil, or in my case, I just took the fat that dripped onto the tray while, while the pork belly was roasting in the oven. And then I put the pork belly in skid side down. The pan is still cold. Now I'm gonna turn the pan on to medium high heat. And it'll take a few minutes to do so, but we wanna let, let it sit on there until the skin puffs up and becomes crispy. You may need to lean it over a few times with some tongs to get, to get the rest of the skin off because the skin is, you know, unevenly surfaced so but you'll see what it looks like later it'll look like that all right and the pork belly's done i'm just gonna let it rest for five minutes before i start cutting to cutting into it and listen to this real quick you hear that that means that skin is crispy now i'm gonna cut some slices off so you can see the inside look at that it's so juicy look at that like i said this is a pretty time consuming thing to make but it's easy and if you have the patience to make it, it is so well worth it like i said pork belly is is my second favorite meat right behind steak and just look at the look at the meat right there it's so juicy and, and so tender i'm gonna eat a piece with the skin just so you can hear how crunchy it is mm. like i said that meat is so moist and it's so tender and juicy mm. But if you try this out, leave in the comment section down below and tell me what you thought, whether you liked it or you hated it. If you liked it, so you thumbed up, hate it, so you thumbed it down. I'm sure click subscribe and become a member of the JW Faction on a jury of 10,000 subscribers. See you later.